Even being in shed, like really blue, it still looks amazing. I just have to show this one off. Check this out. Pastel Yellow Belly Inchi Gene X. It's a hypo mandarin. It looks like it's glowing. So pretty. Oh yeah. It's by far one of the most colorful snakes we have here, actually. This, this beats it. This is the most colorful snake in the world. What's up, YouTube? Okay, guys, we are doing a top 10. Well, I'm not really gonna do top 10. I'm gonna probably do like 12, just because I was counting 10 already. But I'll show you guys two extra ones. But we're gonna show off our most colorful snakes over here in our collection at AEP. And who's better to hear than help me than the turrets, McGurts. <laughs> Come over here, turtle. Guys, we wanted to tell you thank you very much for all the views and all the likes that you guys have been giving us recently on our um, channel. We yeah. really, really appreciate it. Thank and our much. Spanish channel also is doing really good, man. So all the Spanish-speaking people that are also watching this, thank you guys very much. If you guys ain't already subscribed, please subscribe and please give us a thumbs up. It's been really, really helping our channel and just making it grow more and more. So from the bottom of our heart, we want to tell you guys thank you very much. <laughs> and we're gonna do this vlog for you guys. So we're gonna show you guys some of our most colorful snakes over here in our collection. Not in any specific order. We're just gonna show you what stands out. All right, so turtle, let's start off with the little ones over here. Let's start okay, off with the little, little ones. Big, little baby, little okay. baby. The first one I have to start off with, guys, is none other than one of the GNAX, just because you guys know I love orange and it's just super colorful. So here we go. Look at this. Big shout out to, uh, to Jesse and my nephew. They just did a full clean here. It's that time of the month where they have to do a full clean and it just looks amazing. Look at this brand new Ripta chip all over the place. Big shout out to them. So here we go. So right here we have an Orange Dream Yellow Belly Inchi Genex Pied female. And guys, I have to start off with this one, like I said, just because you guys know I love orange and what better than to have this in the pied? I mean, if you want to talk about colorful, that's a colorful snake. Let's get to number two. So, since we're already on orange, Do let's it. come over here. Because this is another one that's super orange that is just orange. Oh, that's not the one I was thinking. Oh, here we go. Hold on, hold on. Let me take this out. Whew, man. This is crazy. All right. So, right here, we have a black pastel pinstripe ultra male hypo, also known as the ultra glow. And I'm not sure if the camera's picking this thing up. But man, this thing is straight up orange. Is it picking it up? Uh, it doesn't look super orange. Soup? It looks more yellow. Oh. But it Maybe looks... I'm just colorblind. No, it's it's not doing any justice. Okay, okay. <laughs> yeah, guys, I'm telling you guys right now, it's, it's orange. All right, another one I'm gonna show you guys is, it's it's in shed right now, but you can still see the colors on this thing. This thing is really, really beautiful. Even being in shed, like really blue, it still looks amazing. I just have to show this one off. Oh, I'm sorry for disturbing you guys. And she's well into shed. She's like completely blue. But honestly, she's very similar to this color. And she's also gonna be going this year. So right here we have a super chocolate GHI vanilla hypo. And we actually had measured her follicles and she's at 14 millimeter follicles. And she is bred to an ODYB desert goes head hypo so could you guys imagine we're gonna get some chocolate orange dream yellow belly ghi vanilla hypo head desert ghost that's gonna be insane so all right guys so that's number three since we're on the hypo side already um let's show another fan favorite of everybody's one second another hypo look at this man if this is not beautiful i have no idea what is and if you guys don't know that is beautiful. <laughs> Just playing. So no, I'm not playing. I mean, you are. You are. But um, right here, guys, we have a GHI Mojave Hypo, and again, she's one of our most, you know, liked snakes that we've put up on Instagram. Very beautiful snake, man. Love this thing. Could you see how blue it is? What is it like? A bluish gray? It's like a lavender gray, purple. Okay, so right next to her. So what's this, number four? So we're about to show you guys this female without the hypo and then one added gene to it. And honestly, I think it's amazing. I'll show you guys a comparison right now. But again, we have a GHI Mojave, but this has gravel. Now look at this, man. This thing is beautiful, man. I love this. All these snakes that I'm showing here are just amazing. And all of them are females that I've showed you guys so far. But again, this is a GHI Mojave Gravel. And again, we have a GHI Mojave Hypo. So that is pretty cool, man. Very similar looking as far as the pattern. Just the color, the Hypo blues, blues this one out a lot more. Gray, lavender, whatever you want to call it. But yeah, these are some very, very pretty snakes right here. It's a great comparison. It's like compar comparing like you twice. Right. Right. I got in trouble earlier today guys. I'm trying to get them points back again. 
So let's go on to our next one. Ooh, look at this, man. Oh, I love her. You know, at first we didn't clip her because, you know, I was like, oh, I, last minute I was like, oh my gosh, we have to show this. So right here we have a lavender snow. And lavender snow is pretty much just a lavender exantic. But yeah, this girl's also breeding right now. She's breeding to a Mojave Cypress exantic. So hopefully we could get some exantic Cypress, which will be het lavenders. But yeah, this girl is beautiful, man. If you want to talk about colorful. She's like really creamy looking. Yeah. She is super cool, man. I'm telling you guys, the camera's not doing any justice on these beautiful snakes. Oh, and by the way, for you guys that said that I put the pictures of the Sunset Clown, I just put up there really, really quick. I'm gonna re-put it up there again, just so you guys could see. And yeah, I'll leave it on there for at least five seconds. So enjoy this beauty. All right, guys, isn't that a beautiful snake? Okay. So another one, we're gonna go with the GeneX. For you guys don't know what GeneX does, GeneX honestly has the pieds keeping their colors at an older, older age. If you guys notice a lot of pied combos, they dole out a little bit, they still look great. But look at this adult that's already breeding. Check this out, Pastel Yellow Belly Inchi GeneX. Now you're gonna tell me for being an adult female that's already breeding, and look at these colors, man. Whew, this is nice. I mean, wow. seriously, amazing. I lost count, so let's go back again. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. All right, we got three more. So two, the two of them that I'm gonna show you guys right now are not ball pythons, but their colors are so amazing that I just have to bring them out. One of them, I don't even know what the actual combo is, but um, I just call it the orange gene. Let's bring her out. Oh my gosh, she's in shed. <laughs> Wow. All, All right. of the pretty ones are in shed right um, now. <laughs> yeah, you know, and to be honest, we were going through a lot of them and they were in shed. So I'm gonna show you guys another one. I'm gonna show you a Mandarin Hypo. Look at this, man. To me, this is one of like the prettiest snakes as well. It's a Hypo Mandarin, and you can see the orange and the purple on this girl. I mean, in person, she looks even crazy. I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but Tina didn't oh, say no, so I would say it's doing pretty good. It's probably her camera skills. Dang, they're is it pretty. looking, is it looking gooder, like the kids say? Aw, it's gooder. Remember? Duh, that's gooder. All right. Perfect. So again, I'm gonna pull out the other retic that I want to. I mean, you know what? I'm still gonna pull her out. But yeah, it just you sucks. Just, you just guys kind of get an idea. Shade. I mean, you guys already seen it, but she's a lot creamier looking, but she's usually a super, super bright orange. But right now she is super, super creamy. Ooh, get that camera, girl. Get that camera work. Yeah, beautiful snake, man. I cannot wait until she hits, you know, 47 feet and like 380 pounds. It's gonna be amazing, man. I didn't exaggerate with that, you know. This next one, is super super flighty so i'm gonna use my david levine stick david levine actually mentioned this uh he's actually the inventor of this stick because um my buddy david levine's super afraid of ball pythons kind of like matt byron but matt byron kind of you know evolved a little bit so now it's uh onto um the levine stick so let me use this real quick because this thing is going to probably come out and try to bite me but once i get her out she's going to be good i love the levine oh stick. my gosh now this is colorful wow this, this beats it. This is the most colorful snake in the world. Look at that. that. Dude, the camera's picking up the colors for sure. It is. 325 million percent it is. Right? Right. Yeah. Guys, <laughs> let me tell you right now. Probably stick with two cups of coffee. Don't go more than three. Yeah, all right. Actually, you know, to be funny, guys, I mean, to be honest, guys, I'm only on three hours of sleep. But um, again, right here we have an Annery Jag. Jag. Reticulated Python. Beautiful, beautiful snake, man. Dude, if I was a snake, this is how pretty I'd be. Yeah, definitely. All right, guys. So we are getting close to the to the end of this vlog. So I'm, I left the best one for last. I mean, to me, this snake is just amazing. Um, it's it's come along. <laughs> <laughs> I thought you were gonna start spitting. I, mean, I was about to, but I got stuck. <laughs> okay. Whew. Oh, yeah. I mean, how do you not finish off with this beauty? Yep. Look at this man, an IMG boa that we got in Atlanta. Whew. Speaking of Atlanta, big shout out to Alyssa, man, with Full Throttle Reptiles. That girl's straight killing it on the YouTube, man. So beautiful. And I don't know if it's picking up all the iridescence, but man, this thing is just amazing. One of my favorite pets right here. This thing is just gorgeous, man. I take it back. If I was a, um, a snake and I was on this countdown, can't um, take it back. I wouldn't. Oh, okay. Nope. Either one, both of them were so cool. But yeah, so this is the last one we're gonna show. That's a lie, I'm gonna show you guys like three more. But yeah, beautiful snake right here. One that I should have shown, I mean, she is super beautiful too, is this black pastel candino. Oh, yes. Look at this. Is this not beautiful? That's beautiful. 
Please tell me the, the camera's picking up its beautiful colors. You would have said no right away, so it's doing some. It, is. it looks okay. like it's glowing so pretty. Oh yeah, it is. Yeah, beautiful black pastel candino, man. This thing is just awesome. Yeah, so that was our like top 11, top 12, around there somewhere. Now I'm gonna just show you guys some other beautiful snakes that we have here that just pop out to me. They're just super colorful. Let me show you this uh, spot nose red stripe clown boy. <laughs> this guy, dude, is one of our, you know, massive breeders over here doing a lot of work over here at AEP. But as you can see when I'm talking about colors, I mean, he's already full grown and he looks insane. Look at all the flames right here. Beautiful little guy. Here's two that I hatched out that I think are super, super bright as well as, as far as colors. Right here is an orange dream clown, 100% head pied male. And guys, this guy is available if you guys are interested. Again, orange dream clown, 100% head pied male. It's a beautiful guy, man. And then on top of that, oh my gosh, I'm so I got so lucky with this off of a pos hat. Look at this. Orange Dream Leopard Clown Pied Female. Oh, dude, she is so beautiful. Gosh, I love this snake. I had to kiss this snake. So beautiful. Oh my gosh. I have to show a little bit more. Look at this, guys. Super Red Stripe Pastel Yellow Belly Het Clown. Isn't that amazing? Yes. Super Red Stripe Pastel Yellow Belly Het Clown. This guy is, well, actually, it's a female. She's amazing. And then, oh man, how could you not leave this one out of there? I mean, dude, pastel, cypress, red stripe, yellow belly. This is by far one of the most colorful snakes we have here, actually. Look at this. So beautiful. And guys, right here, we have an Inchi Mandarin. Look at those oranges, man. Look at that belly. That's the cutest belly I've ever seen. Girl, let me pull my shirt up. Let me see. No. <laughs> but yeah, another beautiful snake, man. Firefly Mandarin. Is that not colorful? That's very colorful. Look at that yellow. Sorry guys, I'm gonna throw a lot of snakes up in here. You should just call us the top 100. Yeah, might as well. I'll show you guys some holdbacks. All right, so right here we have a, I don't know, we're thinking um, Mojave, a Yellow Belly, Orange Dream, Pied. All right guys, I'm gonna show you just one more, just real quick. So I don't wanna just bore you with a lot of snakes, but I just think these are really pretty. And right here we have a Black Pastel, Clown, 100% head hypos. And if you guys are interested, these were on the market. So some of the snake cells did end up going through. So if you guys are interested, we have 1.1, 1, .1, one male, one female. These black pastel clown head hypos. All right, guys. Well, I hope you guys enjoyed this vlog on a nice, beautiful, beautiful Sunday, which is not Sunday for us, but I know this will be going up on Sunday, so I'm saying that. So it's kind of like we're watching it together. <laughs> but guys, seriously, I hope you guys are staying safe and hope you guys are staying healthy. As always, guys, we appreciate all of support. If you're not already subscribed, please subscribe and please hit that like button. We'll really, really appreciate it. Till next time, guys. Peace. Peace.